Hey guys, welcome back to Bold Cinema, today we are going to explain a classic movie. Where three beautiful girls living near a beach in Tunisia, are desperate to have their first experience of pleasure, that too within one month. This classic French movie was released in the year 1996, so without wasting any more time, let's begin. In the beginning of the film we see Goulette, a small coastal town in Tunisia. Where some family members are taking nap at daytime. A young boy named Tom secretly gets up, he is trying to get out of the house without letting anybody know. The young friends meet and goes to take another friend with them, who is sleeping next to his sister. The teenager group is enjoying their summer holiday, they walk to Hatch's house, an old holy man who is well respected in the area. Hatch tried to go to Mecca but never succeeded, one of the friend tells his friends, that Hatch has seven wives before, he killed them one by one and buried them right here. In the next scene we see three beautiful girls working in a wedding dress, it is town's only boutique owned by Madame Casinova. Name of the girls are Tina, Gigi and Fritna. These young ladies are talking about romance and pleasure, Gigi tells them her friend and his girlfriend went to see a movie, they enjoyed private time in the theater. All of them are desperate to have their own romantic experience, Frida and Gigi believes that girls should have their first experience before marriage. But Tina is afraid of such idea, she tells them her father will kill her if she ever tried such a thing. They tell her he will never find out as they will do it secretly. Frida along with her friends visit the church, all of them pray so that they can have courage to indulge in such an experience, they take an oath, that they will have their first romantic experience within a month's time. Tita is listening to the girls secretly from behind. As they come back to home, their teenage brothers greets them outside home, and informs that Maxa is back from Italy. He is their cousin brother and a very successful man. Maxa is considered to be very handsome, and the girls are excited as he is back. Frida's mother is Mariam, she is busy in preparing food, as the old holy man Hatch is invited for the lunch today. Frida wants to go to beach with her friends, she asks her mother why everyone is scared of Hatch, because she knows he is not a holy man, people are in delusion. All the girls goes to beach, Max is also in the beach meeting his old friends, Giggy and Max looks at each other for some time. Next we see Giggy's family having lunch, Silas sent a special dish for them. Actually the three girls and families are relative, they live happily close to each other. Tina was about to go for shower, but her mother forces her to sit and eat with the family. Boys group decides to go upstairs and secretly watch all the girls having bath. Here Mariam is serving food to the old holy man Hash, he is not only a priest, but he owns most of the property in the town including Frida's house, he earns money as rent. After the lunch he gets up to wash his hands, by mistake he opens the bathroom door and see Frida taking shower. His heart starts pounding as he is overjoyed looking at the sight. Here the boys are hitting inside a room, and watching Tina and Gigi taking bath in the terrace. Frida is serving tea to her father Yusuf. She asks for his permission to go out with her friends. He agrees and tells her to take her brother with her. Yusuf is a ticket collector in local train, during lunchtime he goes to a restaurant and meet his friends. He tell them people in the town don't like people from other religion, and he also don't like Jews. At night Mariam along with her sister and friends are sitting for dinner. Frida and her friends are sitting as well. Hatch is standing there looking at Frida in an unusual way. Here Tita, who works for Hatch is discussing the accounts with him. She says you should marry a beautiful girl, why are you living alone? She tells him she will find a girl for him, he becomes happy. Now Frida's elder sister is getting married, all the relatives and neighbors are helping the family. During break Gigi tells her friends, we cannot do anything if we sit like this, we should romantically involve with first three people we find, when we go out of this house. As they go out of the house, they find three weird men ready to be their friends. The boys informs them that they have booked a private room in Frida's sister marriage hall. They were just fooling around but shockingly enough, the girls agreed. Now Frida's sister Lucia is getting married, her parents are busy welcoming the guests. New couple is sitting on stage while other people are enjoying the delicious food and music. Here Hatch is looing at Frida only, he fell in love with her, from the day he looked at her in bathroom. Now orchestra starts performing and the guest starts dancing. Beautiful women dances in front of Hatch, but his mind is fixed on only Frida. One of the three boys comes and take the girls with him. Boys have a special arrangement, of juice mixed with wine for girls. 
Hatch is looking for Frida and getting suspicious about her. Here the girls drink wine and choose as boys according to their preference. Hatch is getting mad now, he is looking for her all over the place. As the girls turns of the lights and finally starts making out, Hatch along with their fathers raid the room. The boys instantly runs away with their lives. Back at home the parents beat the hell out of their daughters, they warn them never to meet their friends again. Now the girls are separated as they are not allowed to meet each other. Not only that, the fathers also fight with each other and decides not to see each other's face from now on. Those boys took the help of one of their friends, and hiding in a metal shop. Their friend informs that the parents are looking for them. Hatch is asking Tida, he heard a news that Yusuf's daughter is not a virgin now. Tida says it cannot be said now, we will have to wait and watch. In the morning the fathers go to their work, but not looking at each other. Girls are depressed and spend most of their time sleeping in their homes. Tina tells her mother that she hates her country, but her mother says it is a paradise. Here Maryam wakes Frida, and shows her how to wear the traditional dress. Frida says it's too hot inside, she will wear nothing inside the dress, if at all she wears it ever. Tida visits Tina's home and shows her some photographs of boys for marriage. Here Hatch visits Frida's home, luckily her parents are not at home. He was overjoyed with the situation and Frida appears cleaning the floor. Frida is very angry at him as she cannot go out because of him. But then she uses her mind, as she notices what he desires. She tries to charm him with her beauty and asks him for a favor. She asks him to convince her father, to let her complete her sewing classes, and in return, she will wear the traditional dress and meet him alone. He happily agrees. At night Gigi's mother tries to talk to Tina's mother, she says the girls did nothing wrong, but her husband takes her inside. Now the mothers visits church and pray to God to turn their husbands into friends again. Frida's dad is having a drink in his friend's hotel, he makes him remember the old days. Hatch calls Yusuf outside and says, you should let Frida complete her classes, and he also expresses his desire to marry his daughter. The boys sent one of their friends with a message of love to the girls. They really don't know whether the boys love them but only because of them the girls turned into women. Tina tells them, she knows a place where they can meet the boys and complete the unfinished task. Yusuf is also missing his cousin brothers, he goes to one of them and starts to talk. Then both of them visits the third one and the matter is resolved, they become happy friends again. Now the final morning comes when the girls are going to execute the plan, it is a festival and Hatch is happy as well. He visit Frida's home and finds out a piece of paper with marks, he instantly knew the girls are going to run away. Here the girls meet the boys in decided place, and tells them they have 15 minutes to make out. Hatch runs to the parents and informs them that their daughters are running away. Yusuf becomes angry with Hatch and tells everyone that he wants to marry his young daughter. But Tida tells Yusuf, that she heard the girls talking in church, that they will make out in the festival day. Now the parents runs to the Carthage to find the girls, here girls are done with their session and extremely happy. One friend informs the girls to run away as the fathers are coming, the girls leave before their arrival and the fathers finds no one there. Then they look for the girls and finally finds them in church praying. They are relieved that the girls are pure and did not do anything which the Hatch said. Hatch is angry and threw Tina's mother out of her house, now Frida hears this and turns really angry. She goes to her room and wears the traditional veil without earing anything inside. She hides her face, walks on road and reaches Hatch. He asks hi she came to him now. She opened the veil in front of him, and this evil old man became too excited looking at her like that. His hearbeat raised beyond safety, his heartbeat raised beyond safety levels and he falls down dead. Frida runs away before anyone could see her. This act of Frida saved the town. All the fathers are happy and decides to go for fishing. Here the girls are together happily as well, without any restrictions. The houses are allotted to the people living in them. And it becomes a happy ending. This is the end of today's episode, hit the like button, comment down your views below, and subscribe to this channel for more bold movies. I will see you soon, take care.